The third world is not poor. You don't go to poor countries to make money. There are very few poor countries in this world. Most countries are rich. The Philippines are rich. Brazil is rich. Mexico is rich. Chile is rich. Only the people are poor. But there's billions to be made there, to be carved out and to be taken. There's been billions for 400 years. The capitalist European and North American powers have carved out and taken the timber, the flax, the hemp, the cocoa, the rum, the tin, the copper, the iron, the rubber, the bauxite, the slaves, and the cheap labor. They have taken out of these countries. These countries are not underdeveloped. They're overexploited. The third nah, nah, that's crazy, right? See, that's the type of game these folk play. These folk want you to think that these countries are poor, but they're not. I keep telling y'all, he who controls the, the, the data, the, 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 the perception, controls the people. See, a lot of us ain't never been to them countries. So I want to know if they're poor or not. We just go off what they say. Like I told you, I met plenty of people from Africa, and I always ask them, man, have you ever seen a lion? Or what? They ain't never seen that shit with at the zoo. But they'll make it seem as if these people running around and like they bush babies and shit. And they probably, that's why I say, bro, these are some greedy ass people. You're dealing with the devil. You look no further. You get what I'm saying? And these countries, like you say, these countries are very rich in resources. This is what we call God's money. You did gold and different things, silver, and um, not just gold, silver, metals, or any of that stuff. We're talking about different resources from plants to fruits, you know what I'm saying? And, the, and the, this is the kicker. This is the main thing which I ought to focus on. The people that run those countries are in cahoots with the people that run this country. See, there's a top tier that nobody want to talk about. I keep telling y'all, all these motherfuckers on the same accordions. It's us that's separated. America is in cahoots with Australia. Australia in cahoots with China, Japan, all these major countries. The ones at the top who run the shit, they all together. Running our ass. And, one, and this is what I want you to see. That was a very important video I just showed you. Because I want you to understand. I want you to think. These countries aren't poor. <laughs> at all. <laughs> see, we grew up in America thinking that America was the greatest country in the world. They sold that shit. Oh, man, we the free land of the home of the, of the brave and all this other shit. Man, that's some bullshit, man. That's bullshit. You feel me? Because at the end of the day, see, we haven't... And see, all these videos coincide. That's, that's one thing I love. Like I said before, when I did a video a couple of days ago, a day ago or so, or whatever. When you don't go and experience things for yourself, you're only going to take what people tell you. Right? And that's what they want to do. They want to tell you what it is over there. They don't want you to go experience that shit for yourself. I just did a video about this. When you let a man... Um, tell you what something is to, to where you believe it, then you give up the ability to go see for your damn self. How crazy is that? See, I be telling y'all, bro, I break my videos down very simple. You don't have to be this a uh, fucking scholar to understand my videos. I just want you to see how 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 uh, brainwashed we are. How we've been lied to. You know what I'm saying? How they use the, the media. How they use these different outlets. They just tell us what the fuck they want us to tell, to, uh, tell us. This is why I say it's important for you to see it for yourself. Because I tell you all the time. If you hate another person because of shit, color, race, whatever. Why? Who told you that? Hmm? A lot of people hate people and that person ain't did a damn thing to you. See, these things that they use against us when it comes to psychology. Because it's just like this. Uh, when it comes to black folk, it don't matter if you ever... Went to jail in your life and never did nothing. If you black in certain cases, you gonna always be to blame. And y'all, some people may say, "No, nah, that's not true." That's a damn lie. We all be, we all at some point is guilty by association. At some point, you never look at an individual and say, "Now I don't say everybody, but for for the majority, we talking about the majority. The majority of people will look at a person as opposed to." That group of people or that person pertaining to a certain group of people. It goes for white people too. They go for Japanese, they go for Chinese, they go for all the Neezes and everything else. I'm not just talking about one color, we're talking about all colors. But this shit comes from the top tier. 
the motherfuckers who got the radio stations, the television stations, and they the ones who paint the pictures. And all I'm trying to tell you is they'll tell you though this they make it seem like this is a poor country. Bullshit. Bullshit. And all I all I want to do is just bring that to your attention. Don't look at these countries like they're poor. And not only that, anytime they put attention on something, it's for a reason. See, the thing it is, I ain't gonna make this video that long. The thing of it is, they want you to see something in the way that they want you to see it, right? So that they can paint the picture for you. See, when you're born, you've been given these options. You've been given a race, given a color, given a religion. You ain't even experienced this stuff for yourself and said what you want it to be. And this is what indoctrination does. So a lot of times y'all listening to your doctors and certain people, that's indoctrination. I'm not saying all doctors like that, but there's a very few doctors that's going to give it to you blood raw. That's going to tell you, don't take that shit. You got a few doctors that's because they is in their DNA not to just say, I'm finna do this for a couple dollars. But then you got some other doctors. I don't give a fuck. Tell you whatever they want to tell you just to make the money. And I've done videos where there's a lot of doctors that was standing over people as they was unconscious on the, on the, on the, on the surgery table. Talking about all type of shit. Saying all type of you know, racial slurs and all type of shit. Yeah, that go on. They, they filmed it. And also, I had the video, the video, not the video, but I had the audio of it. And that same dog that got fired, yeah, he, you know, he, they took his practice, but pff, come on, man. All I'm saying is, we need to put a, a stop to the people that run and govern the world. I'm on their ass. Because I'm trying to tell y'all how these people use certain things against us. We hold all the power. Believe that. We hold all the power. But by they done separate us and tell us what the fuck they want to tell us and we just running around and going off of this and we going to work every day. We staying busy. We trying to get the business. We trying to do that. We don't have time to sit and think something ain't right. Anyway, man. I ain't want to make this video long. I definitely want y'all to understand and see that um, we have to experience stuff for ourselves. Stop letting these motherfuckers tell us how to see things and if you think about it 80 percent of your life if not more have been told to you you ain't experienced nothing think about it it's your boy papa duck i'm out hold on hold on come on come on what the business is what the leak read yeah